Welcome back to Peglin. I'm trying any new combos, new strategies, anything that is brought in with the new updates. I got the round roll, second game with this character, the uh, debuff character. I uh, hope I can get something exciting out of it. Oh, I got a bomb, that's pretty exciting. Actually, this is one hell of a run out. Too bad it's wasted on a 10 HP enemy. Uh, good times. Well, let's keep racking away at it. The early game has ended. Hopefully I can get something good. Double Trouble's fun. You know, I'm actually surprised there aren't any orbs that do multi-attacks. You know, instead of just, like, doing a single attack that does X amount of damage, it would be two attacks that do half that amount of damage. Double Trouble just made me think of it, even though that's not really what it does. Another thing I'm surprised about is that there are no relics related to poison. I am surprised. There's a whole mechanic, and, I mean, I guess I couldn't think of any that don't just seem like boring stat buffs, and... You know, maybe that's fair. Maybe there just isn't anything great. But it is still surprising. And I mean, if it does make you think, you know, what sort of synergy would you want with poison in relic form? I don't know. The only thing I can think of is just make the poison deal more damage or add more poison. Neither of which are very exciting. But I mean, there are some other boring relics. It wouldn't be alone in that regard. Match Orbshka? Meh. Since I have good crit damage, I might as well double down with a ballad. Though in comparison to my stones, it just looks sad. So I think I'm actually just gonna not shoot it until it's upgraded a decent amount. Because yeah, I very much prefer my 3-5 stones when... It's early game and damage matters most. I'm just planning for later. That's kind of the idea behind the whole thing. Ooh, get a chance to do a crit. I will seize that moment. Wasn't a good run out at all though. This was a lot better. A lot better, perfect. Roundabout's just one of those funny orbs. It doesn't seem great. It just seems funny. Then I'll upgrade this so it can start becoming useful. Unfortunately, I don't get to start off with a super crit because, well, I guess I was going to say the crit seemed pretty automatic, but I guess in this game, nothing is automatic. Pretty good set of power slides, though, so I can't complain. This is tough. I almost want to bounce back. That was perfect. Could not have asked for a better shot, although well, it kills the enemy. There's nothing to hate. See if I can get one to go on the outside, one on the inside. I can't believe it. These shots are going wonderful. Awesome stuff. See if I can get it bounce back in the center, hit the refresh. I Every single shot has been exactly how I envisioned it. This is rare. I usually don't execute this well. This one, well, still could be fine because of the crit there. Does it kill? No. Poison would have killed. Well, now I just want coins. All right. Oh, another volley. And another double trouble. I think I'll take both, because they'll both be worth upgrading with time. I think if there was any orb to... Oh, Crit Fleece. Or Crit Crest. We'll go Crit Fleece. That's definitely better. If there is any orb to just do, like, multiple attacks per shot, it would probably be Double Trouble. It just feels like a ball that would do that. And I think the reason why it would matter is because round 12 click, Quince, this relic could then have two debuffs applied. That would be, like, the cool synergy. And it is a cool synergy. I should play like this here. Knowing that whatever I shoot does not matter. Am I going all in on crits? I don't think that all in. I think I'm going to start saving money for the shop. Welcome, bats. Prepare to be bombed. Oh, good. Okay. It's always good when I get both bombs in one shot. Makes it feel way less wasted. Oof, didn't hit the back bat. You hate to see it. I don't know if I'll get that refresh in there. Eh, it's tough to dig out. It's kind of all I care about, though. Nice. Five crit damage. As long as it ends up in the middle, it should represent decent damage. It didn't end up in the middle, so the damage is shit. I don't know if this will crit. Nope. That's a tough one to get. All right, so I'm taking damage. Please don't happen again and we'll be good. Uh-oh, it's happening again, isn't it? Yes, it is. 
I don't know if this will hit many pegs, but I need the crit more than anything else. Now that I got there, do I want another double trouble? I don't know. Let's just get a whole build full of them. Yeah, I can upgrade at any time, but I can't always take the orb I want. What's this? Oh, yeah. Crits and refreshes contribute to damage. If this ends up being a crit build, I would probably end up getting a lot of crits. That damage will make it look flashier, but might not matter. I think I'm just mostly waiting for most enemies to show up on the screen. Then a big bomb would be helpful. Like right in here. One more bomb! Oh, it's okay. It's regular damage is ass. Not like much was wasted. Can I hit that bomb and this crit? Yes, I can. Oh, and a times two. All right, that's going to the moon. It's over. All right, this is going to be a good shop. Coins contribute to damage. Pegs are converted to bombs. Let's do coins contribute to damage. I'll head west and that's all I can commit to. Good. More coins is nice. Blind is nice. Max HP is nice. But I will take coins. Blind or healing? Because the next thing is going to be removing an orb. And this is the debuff character. So, I mean, you want more blind. Since it already naturally applies blind. Yeah, I, it's mostly I want the stone gone because I need the deck thinner. Stone doesn't have multi-ball. Okay, let's see how this pans out. Pretty poorly, not gonna lie. Oh, there are no good crits lined up. Okay. At least I got an enemy dead. Use some bombs. Okay, I'll probably crit here. Well, there that goes. That's a lot of overkill. I need some overwhammer in my life. Hate taking damage to this freaking plant. The bane of my existence. Want a 2 5? Might as well take a 2 5. In case it doesn't kill, it's gonna be helpful. But it did. Alright, so I'm through the shop. Pulterb Geist is good because I have no AoE. I have no AoE. Okay, you take the Pulterb Geist then. Got just a bunch of low tier pegs. How about this? Bulwark Synergy. Well, I take it and I sit on it. Why? Wait, why is this a relic that can be offer, offered to the Boundrel? Roundrel, whatever. Is this character capable of receiving Bulwark? If not, though, that shouldn't be there. And honestly, if we want classes to have their own class identity, then that shouldn't be there regardless. I don't like that that relic's there at all. That sucks. Feels like a total fucking waste. <laughs> so does uh, all this damage going into the fucking tree. I should go for the crit, because sometimes I double crit and double up. Not today. Okay, now I can pull Turb Geist while the mole is away. Build up the damage for later. Do the bad shots into the tree, the good shots into the mole. This is one of the good shots. Well, hitting crit is necessary. Yeah, he's not making it out of this fight. Uh, shooting this dagger was a mistake. That's a lot of wasted damage. Well, the mole wasn't coming now anyway. I'm actually going to take a reload right now. Just, yeah, because I figured the mole would show up. I think I'll crit. I'll try shooting here, see what happens. Because sometimes... No. Oh, well. Brambling the mole does nothing. Okay, I'm getting low. You're scaring me a little, mole man. Big shot over here. Should be Oda. Yeah, there we go. A refresh. Mole's got to be done for. I think the three damage should add up to enough. Okay, if I don't die, then any HP is now equal. But now with the money, I can finally start leveling up my stuff. I think Poltergeist is the best, knowing next floor. Oh, I really wanted Matryoshka Shell, so I'm glad I got it. I really want to see how Matryoshka Shell goes with double trouble. Because now it's multiple two and pretty high crit damage that I can upgrade further. And against the wall, so I got a big DPS check coming up. But yeah, I definitely was not in the mood to go uh, Mental Mantle or Molten Mantle, whatever it's called. I just wanted to try this out. Oh, I just sent so much <laughs> damage into a 3 HP enemy. Ew. Alright. Well, I need Overwhammer or something. Okay. 
Gabarate is not the type of building going for. This has massive damage on crit and it pierces. Which way do I want to go? Oh, there's a double shop or a chest elite. Yeah, the more I think about it, the more I want this shop. I'll still, hmm, I'll save my money for the shop then. That's tough, actually. Because I also want cleave orb. Yeah, I think I've decided actually I'll save for floor three shops. Let's go cleave orb. And how does this upgrade? Gets a pretty big crit buff. But this has, you know, multi-ball two, effectively. So I think I'd rather do that. I want something fun from question marks. Right. Losing 4 HP is not fun. Random Relic is fun. Improved Catalyst is the best of the three. I'd settle for Grabby Hand um, because Cleavor pierces, but this is the best one. And I want two question marks to the left. Oh, it's the Haglin. Removing an orb is definitely best. Yeah, I try to slim down the deck. It's getting a little big. Oh, upgrade all stones or remove an orb. I have two stones left. Let's make it one. Well, those were some fun events. Must circle. That is anti-synergy with my crit fleece. That is a negative. So I won't take it. Hate to see my relic wasted. That's half the reason I went this way. I hope that I can find overwhammer from this. Because if not, I'm going to be in for a bad time. Alright, I feel like I gotta get a good ballad going. But I can't snipe that crit. I just gotta pray that I'll fall into it. Okay, happened. Could use a refresh. Didn't get a refresh. But I buffed up my pull torb, guys, so I'm hoping this can go to the moon. Shoot it in here. Got the crit. Can I get the refresh too? Yes. Awesome. Oh, and a crit times two. Beautiful stuff. Well, that's just killing. <laughs> that's wonderful. Let's see how well Cleave Orb does, huh? Nothing unless it crits. Well, it did it. Good job. Now let's bring it home. Nope, he's still alive. Wait, no, he's not. Go bombs. All right, that, I was worried about that fight. Sometimes it's tough, but not today. I mean, Restorb's decent. It's a little late and it's not enough. So I'll just keep slowly upgrading my double troubles. Crits also refresh the board. That's really nice. Yeah, that's wonderful, wonderful. I need more crits, damn it. Oh, another orb removal. Awesome, this deck is getting thin, thin, thin. Hurts. So I'm probably going to have to start healing. Well, it doesn't matter because I'm up against the wall. I do know that on floor three, I will be buying post-battle healing a lot. Nightcap doesn't make sense either because this isn't the Bulwark character. Yeah, it's weird that those relics show up. I don't like it. Yeah, I actually went and checked. The uh, Bulwark orbs do not show up for this character at all. You can just look at like custom start and see what orbs are available. So that really sucks. I have absolutely no idea what they were thinking then. Oh, this is a zero, zero. Well, I did it for the stat buffs because Poltorb guys should hopefully bring it home. Not if it destroys all the damn orbs though. Oh, oh if it doesn't have any attack value, then I get no buff. Oh, that is sad. Yeah, I have no idea what they're thinking for some of the decisions in this. I mean, maybe the update is just rushed or something. That's the only realistic thing I can think of. Well, either way, I'm crushing. Hey, it's a critter ball. That's supposed to help my build. I'll take you. Well, and frankly, I'll upgrade. I'll upgrade you since you kind of help my build go round. Any good from the chest? Heal and reloading. That's not terrible. At least it's not freaking Bulwark. Let's start with a ton of crits. Oh! I got multiple crits somehow. Do I have something that explodes nearby pegs? I mean, I guess I'm not complaining, but the, uh, that thing's not supposed to interact with other crits. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Well, this is what I expected to happen with the build. Too bad it's all wasted on a 60 HP enemy. Overkill of the century. Well, now I know that this Bala does nothing. I guess I should prioritize upgrading it. So, you dealt zero damage, huh? We'll go Pull Torb Geist, since it's guaranteed to do something. And something it did. <laughs> Another double trouble. I can't escape him. There's so many. We'll upgrade the Critter Ball to max. I think I have enough, though. Three is good. 
I will upgrade this just so it can actually attack. And then I'll hold on to my money. I'm not scared of you, Wall. I got six scaling. My, uh... Next shot should have some piercing. Wait, no. There is eight HP left on this enemy. I'll definitely hit bombs. This could probably just win on the spot then. Nice. Get fucked. Not trying to go match your orbshka. I'm trying to go uh, match your orbshka at home. That actually has sick crit damage. Can I get even more crit damage? Skultimate greed. I would have pendant synergy. Not bad. Of course, all this money I've saved up is now going to go to shit. Well, I t I'll take the wand. It represents damage. It's the minesweeper boss. I mean, I effectively paid 72 money to have it, but I don't think I'll be hurting. Is Pultorb guys my best orb? The crits, yes. It's uh, flirting with the crit, but it didn't get there. Maybe this guy will do better. Oh, yeah. Perfect. I'm gonna sick one two punch. Punch and punch. Okay, time to feel like I'm broke a little bit. I don't think I need to create more coins. So let's see, two elites. I guess I'm missing a shop in case of elite. There's one shop later. I don't feel like I need to protect my money too hard. Leave Orb, I think, is a good one to upgrade. Oop, once again, a one-two punch. Let's if this just kills him. How about that? It is a little bit of a letdown that Tier 3 Ballad doesn't at least give two Spinesse. I think that would be nice. Two Spinesse on Ballad. I mean, at Tier 3, you gotta invest a lot to get there. And it's not even that broken. I mean, I guess with Crit Fleece, it's really, really good. But that's because Crit Fleece is really good, really good, not because Spinesse is broken. Wow, that's a, a whole lot of nothing. Ouch. I mean, it's dead. Cleavorb level two, huh? I mean, up against the Minesweeper boss, uh, piercing's pretty nice. So I suppose I'll take it. Upgrade it as well. I don't need another double trouble. First, the two elite fights. It's this asshole. But two good shots and I'll be okay. I get a lot of crits. I mean, you never know. Let's see what happens. That's pretty good. It's not world ending, but it is good. Holter guy's traveling straight up on this map. Little weird. Well, I guess I'm forced to shoot a ballad. Let's hope I hit a crit. Nope. Let's hope I hit a crit here. Okay, nice. This guy's hurting quite a bit, huh? Leave Orb is a 1-8. Come on, give me something good here. That was good. It looked like there was nothing coming out of it for a bit. Ah, the refresh is on the opposite side of the board from the crits. Ah. I probably should have just gone refresh. Okay, at least he's missing. I'm gonna have to heal after this fight, huh? Yeah, I am. I'll heal for the first time and get upgrading. Max out the double trouble. Let's move on. Bombs apply blind. Echo is echo. Echo's good, because then at least the ballads will always attack. And the other things will always attack. At least let me get the extra blind. Although, this is probably really good against the um, Minesweeper boss fight. It is, actually. With that in mind, I'll actually take this. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm not gonna lie. Ballad does feel like one of my worst orbs. Just one Spinesse at this stage in the game now. I don't need it. I might just get that Dag Orb upgraded. Oh, good. I get a setup, then a knockdown. Sweet. Please, no more red bombs. You sure love your damage, but damage them, not me. I'm getting hurt here. Yeah, Dagorb should just speak for itself. 
Okay. I am always healing. I think I'll still upgrade. Actually, I guess tier 3 dag orbs. Pretty good. I could have saved that for after the shop. I should have saved it for after the shop. Damn. It's okay. I'll probably get enough money from this elite that it doesn't matter. I'll start with the cleave orb, knowing that it's just an okay shot. This is where the real setup and takedown happens. Hit that refresh. It's right there. Ooh, I shot that with the refresh in mind. Hopefully this is still good. It's pretty good, yeah. Very likely album wiped out. I think though again, double trouble is the play. Yes, love it. I think I'm actually gonna save my coins for healing until after the shop. I can buy two relics right now. Reload grants balance or persist. I don't like persist. It makes it harder for me to skip to what I want. I could take a little reload synergy. Oh, speaking of skipping to what I want, ambidextry is, is wonderful for that. All right, what relics do you have in store for me? Additional crit is excellent. Maybe wall bounces? Yeah, with all the orbs I have, probably gonna hit the wall a ton. Those were exactly the amount of relics I wanted. What about this? <laughs> Question mark navigation. That would take me to a random lane, right? I like my lane. When the board is refreshed, deal damage to targeted enemy. Nice. So now, after these fights, I'm just gonna be non-stop healing. We'll go pull Torb Geist, probably? Yeah, in hopes I can wipe out the worm. Does that get it? It does. Perfect. Definitely taking a heal. Nice, 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 nice. The fact that the refresh is so close is just perfect. Too bad my Polter guys this all the way at the bottom. Try to get there as fast as I can. I guess I already refreshed. Well, that's a little too much. All right, Cleave Warb's got this. I knew I could count on you, buddy. I can heal the full right now and upgrade. Everything about this is really good. Sure. Tier 3 Ballad. Why not? This is still a scary boss fight. Knowing all the red bomb damage I have to stare down. And knowing my crit balls at the very end. Now, if I want to get the crit ball as fast as possible, I got to constantly skip. So I'll do that. Give me the crits right there. Get there. Oh, wait. It can't split until it hits something tangible. Ew. Okay, well, hit something. Okay, there we go. Alright, this fight's starting to open up a little. I've got to rush my crit maker. Well, but my orbs had other ideas. I think I need to still clear up more bricks here before I go crazy on crits. Yeah, at least get a refresh, right? Okay, that'll do. Damn, I feel like I'm owed a crit here. It's okay, I can make my own crits. Okay. That's fine. Just fine. Go double trouble first. Okay, this is gonna be hitting the big guy, right? Okay, it is, good. He is gaining in strength, but he missed! The fool! Alright, he's two shots from being dead. That's one. And Cleave Orb, I think, just always kills. It would take a miracle for it to not. There we go. Love to see it. Crit build is as good as it ever was. And Double Troubles is cracked with Match Reorb because I thought it'd be. Well, thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. More Peglin coming soon. Have a wonderful day and peace.